covers the cutting edge legal issues in Los Angeles and California and nationally and right on the minute. So you get it instantly online, you get the hard copy. It's really the only source to figure out what's going on in California in the legal world. And it's where I learn about what people are thinking, what people are doing, the issues that are arising. I learn who the experts are in areas where I might need assistance today from attorneys that are still in private practice. You get a glimpse into what other lawyers are doing, what things are happening in Washington and Sacramento that affect lawyers. It covers the entire state, both in depth and with breath. The Daily Journal has been uh, very good at covering all the various areas of the law. When it covers trials, you feel like they're being covered in a, in a balanced way. They do an excellent job at getting the facts correct, um, making sure that credit goes where, where credit should. But they legitimately attempt to get both sides of the story. It's fair, it's honest, and it's tough when it's supposed to be. And uh, it's as good as it gets. I've been reading it for almost my entire career. Now, without the Daily Journal, I really wouldn't be able to really think through some of the issues that are confronting uh, the legal profession today. It's one of the first papers I look at every morning. It's the first thing I look at in the morning. If I'm out of town for a week, I'll go up to the library and take the last week and go through it. The Daily Journal is the legal paper for this region. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. It's a tool that I can't see a successful lawyer uh, thriving without. It is uh, unlike anything all across the country. But I know legal newspapers in New York, Chicago, Miami, etc. There's nothing like the Daily Journal. I mean that from the bottom of my heart.